Shalom, and welcome to the next lesson in the Ancient Hebrew Pictograph and Paleo Hebrew for Kids series. I want to give thanks to the Most High Yahuwah and His Son, Yehoshua, for this opportunity to teach His children about our true language, which is Hebrew. So let's get started. We will go over the three main forms of the written Hebrew language. We will go over the ancient Hebrew pictograph, the Paleo Hebrew, and a little bit about the modern Hebrew so that we are able to trace the modern Hebrew back to the pictograph and Paleo Hebrew. Today, we will be learning about the 22nd and final letter of the Hebrew alphabet, which is Tau. Tau makes the t or t sound. Can you do that? T, t. This sound is similar to the T sound in the English language. Tau in the ancient Hebrew pictograph looks like this symbol here. What does it look like to you? That's right, it is a picture of two crossed sticks. Now, as we have stated before, each Hebrew pictograph carries a meaning and a numeric value. Tau means mark, sign, covenant, signal, sacrifice, and monument. There are some additional meanings for Tau, but we will focus on these common meanings for this lesson. Tau has a numeric value of 400. Next, we will take a look at the Paleo Hebrew. This is Tau in the Paleo Hebrew, which is again, um, a variation of two cross sticks. Now we will take a look at the modern Hebrew. So what Tau looks like today. This is a symbol for Tau in the modern Hebrew. Now let's take a look at some words that begin with Tau. We have Torah, which is the law. Taka, which is blow. Teruah, which is shout. This concludes our lesson today on the letter Tau. We went over the ancient pictograph, the paleo, and the modern Hebrew. We hope that you enjoyed this lesson. Until next time, Shalom.